Hey everybody, it's 6F Cyrus, and I have a, a guest commentator here. Obviously, the game I'm going to be playing this time is Final Fantasy, and it's more of a co-commentary, not a cooperative kind of thing. But go ahead and introduce yourself while I... Uh... Hey guys, this is Blind Man's World. Looking really forward to being able to play through Final Fantasy VIII with the Engage Gamers. So here we go. <laughs> this would be the second attempt at the beginning. We had a little audio tech issue. Well, that's technology for you. It doesn't always work. Here's the opening cutscene, though. Mm. Gotta love this opening cutscene. It, it looks so good. Even before it, uh, HD, I remember thinking this game looks really good in cutscenes. Yeah, it definitely the the graphics do hold up over time. Uh, at least on on this part, even even the main game's pretty pretty darn good looking. Unless maybe it's my my eyes. Maybe they're just really blurry, and I I just don't notice the difference. Something but, I've always said was that Final Fantasy VIII had the graphics engine that they used for Final Fantasy X. Ah, did they? I think That's, so. I, and I, uh, it, it looks kind of that quality, so... I loved Final Fantasy X. Don't get me on my soapbox. <laughs> that was a fun one. <laughs> Give me oh. grid spheres. <laughs> well, speaking of that, uh, we did talk about this last time, but I think I want to bring it up again, the whole possibility of the uh, X3... I haven't heard any more about it, but they're talking a lot about how they're going to bring Sin back and all this kind of interesting stuff. Titus mm -hmm. and Yuna aren't supposed to be together anymore. Oh, Had a falling out. Man, they always have to ruin everything. That's what I thought. You spent a whole game to get Titus back, and now you're just going to make them even more depressed. Good job. Yeah. <laughs> they have a fight once. It's like, oh, I saved your life. No, he died, I don't care! And then they just split up. Yeah, it's like, Jesus. <laughs> freaky. Very freaky. No, I'd, I'd get that game. I don't know if it's gonna, what console it's gonna be on, but I'll get it, if I can. Um, I, that, the thing about that was, uh, when we were talking about it, they're in serious talks for it, which means it's a very likely thing. Yeah. But there's no guarantee of anything at this point. I see one of those kind of situations. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see. Probably act. Mm hmm. I was just gonna say that the game sound is lagging for me a bit here and there. Not uh -oh. lagging, but uh, skipping. Oh. Well, that's no good. Well, maybe you won't get a content ID since it's skipped. Hey, you if I get record. a content ID, I'm gonna yell at Square Enix. <laughs> They've disclaimed the copyright to this game by making Final Fantasies 9, 10, 11, 12, and so on and so forth. Yeah. At least that's the way I look at it. If you're making a game series, you disclaim the last game by putting out the new one. Yeah. Well, and I hope that's the way it goes, because, I mean, Ouch. this is great advertisement. Yeah, advertisement. Yeah, Yeah, that. Yeah. Go ahead. Oh, uh, just, uh... I just saw that slashing scene, too. <laughs> that always hurts. Yes. Ouch. It, it doesn't even have to be you, but a cut there. <laughs> and you know it was deep. Probably deep enough to, to break into the, the nasal cavities. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Smelling the air to the side of your nose. Top of your nose, too. <laughs> yeah, that too, that too. Oh. I'm it's awake okay. now. It's, it's all good. My forehead definitely hurts. Uh, ouch. Ironically, I have a headache at time of recording. <laughs> so I, I, oh, no. Well, That's it's, not good. it's all, that, all that hard work I was doing earlier for a series on another channel that I can't spoil. That's true. That's true. Your let's play of Dance Dance Revolution. No. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to play that once. I'm really, really bad at it. Really, really bad at it. Me too. Me too. I, I'm not very good. I'm not that coordinated in that area of my life. More, more of a drummer, not not a dancer. I was able to play uh, Guitar Hero, and from Guitar Hero I went to bass, and then I haven't played any instruments since. No. No. Since we've been here, I broke two sets of strings, and I gave it up. Uh, and that can be that can be pretty dangerous when you uh, break those strings. That can cut you right open. It's pretty nasty. Well, the second time I was stringing the bass up and it came like two inches from my eye. And I was like, yep. no, no, 
I'm not good at this. <laughs> yeah, I like my eyes. I don't want those gone. It's Quistus. Oh, look, it's Quistus again, just like Ben says. <sighs> She's so pretty. <laughs> she doesn't look as pretty in game. The cutscenes really. Um... <laughs> No, the, the, yeah, the cut, cut scenes <laughs> smooth her out quite nicely. They do. Uh, that librarian look, I just, yeah, I have a soft spot for that. Uh, I think we discussed this before, but I used to have a crush on all three of the girls in this game. Yeah? Even the one with the weird, uh, oh, what does she got, like, boomerang? Not, no, that's not boomerang girl, she's got some weird thing. Nunchucks, I think. The uh, yucky I... girl. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, selfie. We're going to run oh. into her here in a minute or two. Yeah. So it's not really spoilers. No. Well, I figure if, if people are watching this, they, well, you may or may not know about this game, but if you do, we, we'll try not to spoil it too bad. And when we do spoil it, it's because it's likely not a story uh, plot or something that's coming up really soon. Yeah. We'll try and keep the spoilers limited. Like, you, you just know the name of that character. You don't even know if they're at the party, or if they're just someone we talk to frequently, or... Or if it's a dog, or a cat, or a... or something. Yeah. Oh, it's... Oh, um, that's... oh, that's right, Tutorial Land. Yeah. That's okay, I have a magical pause function. You viewers will be missing out on all of the tutorials. <laughs> that's true, this is gonna be like the awesome edition of... Final Fantasy VIII, and, you know, take out all tutorials, and you won't have to deal with anything like that. Or that grinding. Would, yeah, uh, that won't be in there. Now, sometimes I might stop for a bit of magic here and there, but mm. generally it'll be less than ten minutes. Yeah. Ninety-nine percent of the time it'll be less than five, so, I mean, at, at worst I'll just speed it up if people have a problem with it. Right. Well, it'll be nice for us to kind of show, uh, if you guys are interested, if you're the the viewers and stuff, if you're interested in seeing where all the different magics are based on you know where you can draw them from enemies and things, because I don't know unless you use the magic upgrade thing that comes with this game off of Steam, you may not know where to get most of the magics and stuff. So that's true. Oh, that's something I did forget to mention that this is an HD version brought to us by Steam. We love you, Steam, and your sales. Yes. Now, it does change the graphics, probably for the better, uh, but the sound, there's some music it changes that I don't think either of us are, are very happy with in some cases, but in other cases it works out. I, I remember you saying you liked some of the music, too. Yeah, it, and it's probably just nitpicky on my end, but I do like the, the older sounds on some of this stuff. It, it's, it, I know they probably took the HD sounds and kind of crisped them up, but it's kind of like, I don't know, it's kind of like playing a, a record and a CD. The record has this ambiance to it. So the old PlayStation music, just it just sounds... It's got some je ne sais quoi or whatever to it, because that's the game I played originally. So, I don't know. It's Yeah, it's just nitpicking. At least on my end. On my end, it's, I've, I've listened to the game music so much, it's like, hey, wait a minute, why isn't this what I remember it to be? Yeah, exactly. And you get that, like, well, this, 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 what, I played this before, it didn't sound like this! So it's kind of disappointing. Disappointing. I mean, they did it in Final Fantasy VII, the the HD version to the PC port, yeah. Steam. So, except it's a lot more noticeable in Final Fantasy VII than it is on this game. Um, they 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 really messed up the music on FF Seven. So at least I think they did. Uh, oh, now we're getting our Guardian Forces. Cut the cut. Got those already. I'm just uh, checking the message board for the uh, Garden Festival. That's what I meant to do. Uh, like, where is it? There it is. The only reason I'm doing this is because I kind of skipped it last time. And one of the characters in the party is very interested in this. Mm, yes. Well, and this so, is one of those things that you could miss if you played through this game and didn't actually sit at the terminal. You wouldn't end up getting your little Guardian forces. so... Yep. There's, there's quite a few things here that are very interesting that are just sitting there. I just looked at a few of them. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Just like uh, a couple of the characters, apparently. Um, the Trapees uh, have a message board where they talk to each other and pick on each other. Um, yeah. Yeah, a lot of cool stuff is, is in this game with just, just walking around and reading and stuff. If you, if you take the time... Uh, to do a little bit of it, so it's kind of cool. And here's that character we were talking about. I actually said that before they came in. 
<laughs> Oof duh. Well, it's kind of like uh, when uh, Cloud and Aerith ram, ram into each other. You know, um, a lot of this game seems to be the romantic factor of um, Final Fantasy VII and mm -hmm. the uh, I'm a standalone, I do everything on my own kind of guy clashing yet again. <laughs> yep, yep. The, the, yeah. That's the usual Final Fantasy, at least some of these early games. That's the um, kind of story thing since Final Fantasy VII onward. Because even Titus is a little bit, or Titus in Final Fantasy X is kind of like that. Or, um... Uh, what is his name in Final Fantasy IX? Zidane. Zidane, yeah, yeah. Which that's another game I, I I actually do really enjoy that game. I know it's not m very popular amongst most people, but I loved it. So. It's not on my favorites list. I don't dislike it, but um, Excalibur Two is one reason why I really have problems with that game. Mm. Me and a friend almost 100 percented it, and because we didn't pay attention, we missed mm. out on that, and we just stopped playing. We were at the end of the game, uh, uh, final dungeon, and we were just like, nope, we wanted everything, how dare you. <laughs> <laughs> Screw you, I'm going home. <laughs> yeah. You can't make me do that, you can't make me continue, we're doing what we want. That's right. <laughs> Cartman. Anyway, I'm going home. Kitty, kitty, don't get my food, kitty. Yeah, never mind. Um, don't get, get me started on South Park. That's one of those guilty pleasures I used to watch a long time ago. I oh, still, uh... Not as frequently as I used to, but there's a few episodes that I like to watch. Like, for example, Medicinal Fried Chicken, which the creators, uh, Trey Stone and Matt Parker, it, it's one yep. way or the other with the last names. Um, they were saying they were surprised at how something could become less illegal, while something like fast food could become more illegal. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that show. Uh, it's like M Mr. Hanky, the Christmas Pooh. Oh, I mean... That just you, uh, uh, yeah. That's th those are the good memories. <laughs> <sighs> go and go and watch South Park viewers. Go right now. Uh, well, uh, finish this video first, and then go watch South Park for a little while. There goes that kid with my card. Oh, that's right. Oh, we gotta get. Yeah, we gotta pay attention. You gotta play some cards. This is why you're playing, and it's so it's so good that you're playing because you're you're good at the card stuff. I I'm really bad at the cards. Well, uh, one reason why I'm happy to have someone along with me at all is because, uh, not even really discussing it, it, you'll be able to help me keep be more honest in battles instead of just, yeah, I'm going to run over this thing and then get myself killed. Yeah, <laughs> that's true. That's true. Uh, and where I do have problems, I have someone who I can talk to about it with. Exactly. Uh, there's some parts in the game, like there's a, a point where you fight a ruby dragon as another character with his party. Cough, cough, accidental spoilers, cough, cough. Yeah. <laughs> you mean a, a large ruby um, chicken McNugget? Yes. It's not a, it's not a dragon. It's a drake. Yeah, there you go. Uh, and this is kind of why we're not talking about the game already, <laughs> because we're waiting on something. Uh, for anyone who's curious, though, uh, we are a mercenary, basically. We're about to learn how to be a mercenary. <laughs> Yes. And I'm stopping to play cards. <laughs> well, that's the big thing, is this run's going to be getting a lot of the, well, hopefully all of the rare cards that we're going to shoot for, because uh, we can do some really sweet things with the card system, and I personally have never done most of the card stuff, and Buddy Steve here has done all of that card stuff and 100%ed all this good stuff, so it should be really interesting. And hopefully we're going to have some luck here and get the get the one we need. I don't know. I'm really <laughs> nervous right now. <laughs> Breathe. In through nose, out through mouth. Okay, um... Yes, this is... At least we'll tie this with that. Yeah. Dang it. No win, though. It had to be a draw. Get back here! That's my card! <laughs> Just trip him, beat him up, and take the card. I wish! We're learning how to be a mercenary, but we have to learn also how to be nice and play a card game with children. Oh, okay. Oh, and no children are harmed in the filming of this LP playthrough game thing. There. Alright, my um, disclaimer is over. I think they definitely were. He's gonna cry when I take his card. <laughs> Aw, too bad. You better man up and deal with it. Crap. Oh, wow. 
Yeah. Almost checkmate. Yeah. Yeah. What they should have done for this HD version is given you a few uh, bonus cards for the beginning of the game so you could have a, a better time of, of this beginning stuff. Yeah, um, I'm just gonna save because there's a quest that goes on here at the garden and they keep track of how many wins, losses, and draws you get. So draws are better than losses by any means to begin <laughs> with, but it's just something to uh, make something easier later on. Yeah. Good idea. And, and what I might have to do is, is we might take a, a pause from the recording, get a few cards, and make it easier to actually get the card we want. Because if it turns out that he does play the card, I can just unpause. Right. Uh, again, this is kind of a dynamic uh, game project, if you don't like the word let's play, or the words. <laughs> the words. The words. It's a dynamic playthrough, interactive experience. Aha! Get him! And, get him! Then I stop. He's gonna get <laughs> off the screen. Run! No! Oh! Oh! oh. oh. Jump! Jump attack! Jump attack! <laughs> Come on! That was painful. Yeah. Ouch! I felt it over here. Uh, at least I'm not losing cards. That would be worse. That's true. Knock on wood. <laughs> I should have knocked on wood because it's probably going to I happen. did. I knocked on my floor, which is wood right now. That's I it. heard that. I needed it. Yes. Yes. <laughs> no problem. Anti-jinx technology. Wood is like the... This speaks to the universe, man. Yep. Let's see. Well, only so many planets in the universe can produce wood, theoretically, so... Ah, that's true. That's true. Alrighty. Another attempt! At Triple Triad. Oh man. Oh. That's right, I stopped up. Never mind, I have to do. It just remind me of something else that I'm trying to do. Uh, there's a. Uh, what is that game that, that I was playing that's kind of a spoof on all the RPGs? It actually has uh, a card game called Double Duo instead of Triple Triad. So they <laughs> paid some homage to this uh, card game you know, in oh. it as well. And here's our first loss, so we oh, should no. return. You may continue this conversation in a moment, sir. <laughs> Here. Okay, you were Let's talking get... about that Final Fantasy parody game? Oh, uh, yeah, it's, uh... Man, I've got it I've got it on my channel, and I can't remember what the, the game that it was called. It's on Steam. Ah, <sighs> blah, 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 blah. It goes through, like, uh, the beginning of RPGs all the way up to kind of the PlayStation era of... A video game. I can't wow. remember it. Yeah. Oh, I hate that. I hate getting old. My brain just does not work as well anymore. Well, here's a secret for you, Ben. Mm -hmm. I don't remember all the things I'm supposed to remember. Mm -hmm. I keep notes. Oh, that's a good idea. That is a very good idea. I should have notes on things. And another loss. Oh no! Goodbye now! I wasn't gonna record this one, but... Minimog. <laughs> it's... It's oh. present, so... Oh, it's a Minimog! Hmm... Cool. Muggles are fun. Let's do that. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. This is what I wanted. <laughs> the, the, the conniving laugh. You've got your plan all Watch set this. Together. Watch this. I'm gonna get two points at once. Mmm. Eat it. <laughs> I was so happy about that. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Oh no! It went from being a tie to being a loss. Oh, and it can go that fast. That's the crazy thing. So, um, I wasn't gonna record this. Again, but... <laughs> but we are. We'll come back. I'm gonna try this again. Let's see if I can't push him to do the same things. Well, this is the thing with this game. If you really get into the card game, it, there's a lot of... I don't know if it's called content, uh, but a lot of replaying and, and trying to figure this out that has to be done. So, I suppose it's content. I mean, 
the game within the within the structure of the game itself. So. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, I'm in so much pain right now. Really? And we're back. Not because Yay. we want to be, but there's that mini mod card dangling in front of our faces again. <laughs> dangle, dangle. Just let the music hit your ears for a second there, viewers, before I actually do anything. <laughs> it's Mont Blanc! That's what it is. Mont That's Blanc. exactly who that is. Yep. Um, you know, just because I have a side that can take that, you deal with that. Mm-hmm. Take that, evildoers. <laughs> Gotta keep this even. Uh-huh. I'm gonna win by one. That's fine. <laughs> yes! I don't even want to see the next screen. <laughs> I just want to look at those big letters saying you win. You win! Now, I can just take that mini mod card and be on my way. <laughs> don't forget to save. Don't forget to save. <laughs> Of course I won't forget to save. Gotta catch them all. Gotta catch so, are you gonna go around a little bit and try to get some of the other cards, like the um, that Master Tom Bear that we had saw from another person? Um, Anywhere? Yeah, you know, I am gonna get a few cards here. Uh, we will be back and I will tell you what we got and then we'll continue on with the game. And you won't have to see all the tutorials that are coming up, but we will. That's kind of a reason why we're doing this thing with the cards. It's like... Skip them tutorials for a while, but anyway, we shall return. <laughs> yep.